got a short video here for you. It's just something I felt like I need to get out there fast so that people are aware. There's a scam going around. There are scammers trying to steal Facebook pages. This has happened to me quite a lot over the year. People keep trying to hack my Facebook page. It's only got 85,000 likes on it. I don't use it. I don't like Facebook at all. That's why I've left it there. But people still want it for some reason. I think, let me get into it and I'll explain the scam and how to avoid it. So my page actually got hacked in February. They managed to get in. They removed my admin permission. They removed all the moderators. So no one had access except for them. I don't know how they did it, but I think I figured it out and I want to show you so that you can avoid it. If you have a Facebook page or anything that's hackable, I don't know. It's probably the same scam going around, but the way they approach it, they approach influencers with money. They offer money. This one came in last night. So that's why it gave me the idea to make this. I'll read it out so you can kind of know to avoid it. It's from someone called Frey. She came at me with, hey there, we are collecting traffic for our site. We will only give you two ads in a day that you can post on the page. I will pay you $9,000 per week and payment will be made in advance. If you're interested, please respond to me as soon as possible. Thank you. First of all, the $9,000. No one is offering $9,000 for Facebook ads. Why would they? It's outrageous. Secondly, the English isn't so great. So that's like the first kind of red flag when you're looking at essentially brand deals. If someone's offering you a brand deal, they will write it more professionally. They also will usually email me and not send me an Instagram DM. But anyway, they somehow figured out this Instagram is connected to that Facebook page. I went along with it just so I could make this video. So I said, what's up? She said, we want to do sponsored advertisement on your Facebook fan page. We will have some multinational brands and we're affiliated with more than 10,000 brands. We'll send you 10 created ads related to your page's category. You can choose any two of them and place them on your page. I'll explain each thing about it, how it works first. Let us know, how does that sound to you? So I said, uh, what's my page's category? Cause I thought it was interesting. She said that her ads would fit my category. I don't know what category I fall into. Oh, I see now, art and entertainment. I just realized this. Okay, that's the category I'm in. Do you know my page name? The page is not active. This took her 35 minutes to respond. <laughs> and she just sent a screenshot of my page. If she was actually professional, she would have this at hand. She could just type in like view one eye. It's still called view one eye. I haven't been able to change it. It's a verified account. So it's kind of difficult to change a verified account's name. So you have to redo the verification, but I've been trying to change it. I don't know how. If anyone's actually a Facebook person, then please teach me. We want to do sponsored ads on your Facebook page. So I said, sure, where do we go from here? What would you like me to post? We are associated with more than 1000 plus brands and companies worldwide. She's just going over, over the same thing she's already said. We'll send you 10 ads a day. Uh, this is different to the two ads a day she said at the beginning. And you can post any two of them if you don't like all of them, you can ask for a replacement. And then she goes on to say, payment methods are bank, PayPal, cash app, blah, blah, blah. They like to focus on the cash side because it makes you think, oh, sweet, free cash. Really easy to get to cash. You just have to post some ads. See, it seems too good to be true because it is. Okay, we'll send you ads of a business account via our business account. Why should I say that twice? Through email and you can see your ads there and also can place them. Place from there, you get paid for the ad placement. Like she just keeps rem reminding me that I'm gonna get paid for placing ads. It's, tries to make it as simple as possible. She's not actually giving me any information on what brand she works with or anything like that. Let me know your email address. And I can, so I sent her an email address I don't use just in case somehow the email could start the hack process. I don't really know how it all works on her end. So she said, okay, I've sent you the thing. And then she's like, have you received my mail? Are you there? Let's go into the email and just show you how this hack works. It's just fun that I've actually caught someone doing it because this has happened to me many times. They'll come at me with these like professional looking profiles. And so I found the email is says advert account has invited you to work on their business on Facebook. It looks really real. I mean, it looks, it looks legit. Email has come through from notification at facebookmail.com. I don't know if that's significant to anyone, but just avoid that email. I guess if anyone sends you from that, it sounds real, but it's not an actual Facebook email. So there's a giant blue tick. It says ads account has given you access to adverts account business on Facebook. So you can help with their pages, ad accounts and the people who work on them. So this is different to what she said in the actual messages. She's giving me permission to her page when she wants permission to my page. It's really confusing. So let's try this. I'm gonna press the get started button just to show you what happens. Look at how many pages it goes through at the top there. It went through like six different pages. Accept cookies from Facebook on this browser. All right, accept all. See, now it's saying you must log in first to do this, this thing. So I'm look at that. That's the link she sent me. So she wants my login details to get into this, whatever she's given me. Ooh. Obviously I'm not gonna do that. I didn't do that the first time they hacked me, but it's very obvious what's going on. They want me to log in so they have my password and email. And then from there, they can probably do a password recovery from my Instagram and steal my Instagram as well. So when I first got hacked, this was back in February, I don't have the screenshots from the people that sent me the stuff, but I didn't give them a password at all. They asked for permission to post ads through Facebook. It wasn't an email or anything. So I gave them permission to put the ads on and then they somehow took over the whole page. They changed the name of the page. They've changed it to Lady Live 03. So now my Facebook page is called Lady Live 03. It's still on that. I can't can't change it. They've like screwed it completely. See that? Let me see. The apps underneath you and I. No. 
they just changed it. Ooh. They changed the picture, they changed the actual viewer and I name. Somehow Facebook detected this as all fraud and they stopped them and kicked them out. They somehow had permission to kick me off of admin. I've got the screenshot here, like, uh, Mushroom King has been removed from business manager, from managing the page. They took all my permissions away just because I gave them permission to, to put ads on the page. I don't know how they did it, but this one that's sending me now is, is like a worse scam than the first one. Because this one is just quite obvious. They wanted to sign in using this fake Facebook page. This isn't actually Facebook, by the way. This isn't. This is just fake. So if you try to log in there, they're gonna steal your account. Shocking. It's horrible. So obviously I checked out this person's account. It looks like a real account. 450 followers, 33 posts, following 1900. If you just ignore everything else, the follower to following count is disproportionate. She's following four times more than, than she has followers. So the way to get free followers on Instagram is quite obviously just follow a bunch of people. Some of them will follow back. That's what's happened here. They're all the same person. It all looks legit, but it, they're all posted on July 23rd, every single picture, and they have barely any engagement. So they just spammed all these pictures on in July, left the account dormant, and now in December, they're sending me this, this fake business thing. So if you weren't paying attention, and if you're a bit of an idiot, then you would think this is legit and sign in, they'd have your, have your account details. I, I wonder how many people actually do it. Probably a bunch. So shocking. Yeah. The bio says advertising expert were based USA, not based in the USA. New York, it's our company, in one word. Website, and then website, website. I haven't actually clicked on the website. That'd be interesting. So the grammar's not the best. They're probably not English. <laughs> website disabled. <laughs> the account associated with this website has been disabled. Okay, so it's a wow. fake website as well. So yeah, if you didn't look into any of that and you just signed your Facebook account in, they would have everything. They could then try and do a password recovery for your, fa for your Instagram. If you have a big Instagram account, they could potentially get in through your Facebook page. I don't think she actually wanted my page. They could probably steal it, change the name, and keep the, keep the likes. But 86,000 likes is not that much in the grand scheme of things. They probably wanted access to my Instagram because it's more active and it has real engagement. Even if the engagement of right now is low, they still they, they could still use it. They could sell my Instagram, that's another thing. They could also say sell to Facebook if somebody is probably a black market for it. Yeah, that's it, that's the video. Just wanted to give you guys a heads up that this is happening. It's very easy to spot now that you know what to look for. Have you had any of these emails or DMs? Go have a look. Look through your email and just look for anything suspicious that looks like that. If you find anything and you're unsure about it, send me screenshots of the DMs and I'll I'll tell you if it's real or not. Hopefully that's helpful. I don't know if anyone out there has got a Facebook page that might be hacked or just be aware. Facebook sucks, but now they own Instagram, so now Instagram is starting to suck. You can watch these two videos here. This is about vaccines and this one is also responding to your comments. You can watch them both here. Yeah, I'll see you guys uh, in tomorrow's video.